Hey guys, and welcome back to Dino Crisis. When we last left off, we had just bought ourselves some new weapons. This should be interesting. Uh, hopefully. Is that it? They're equipped. Yeah, because apparently we can fire at two targets at once with these, which is, well, I mean, that could be interesting, especially with the Velociraptors, the way they come at us. Now let's go see if we can find our little friend, uh, Dylan. And dig his ass out. Oh, wait. Nope. We are going the right way. More slow spinning discs of doom. Really. They're that pathetic, we can just swap them out of the air. Well, I'm wondering if we're actually going to get one of those weapons later on. They don't seem to be that useful, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Literally just like fire frisbees of destruction. They remind me of uh, hand grenades from the original Mass Effect, actually. Do you remember those? They were really weird. Never really liked how grenades worked in the original Mass Effect. But then, I never really liked the original Mass Effect. Oh, hello. It was only uh, when I came back to Mass Effect years later and played that game that it really clicked with me and I really enjoyed it. <clears throat> we need to find some dinosaurs, man. We need to get some points. Nothing? Oh, hello. Oh. Oh, man. Mega firepower, you say. Even though they're ripping these things out of the sky. I'm enjoying these guns. Although, trying to shoot these guys is a challenge in itself. Okay, we got them. Oh god, there's another one. Not quite sure how this is working. Like, do they... Do they come back? Oh yeah, they must be coming back every time we change camera angle, right? But these things are making absolutely short work. They seem to lock on a lot easier as well. <laughs> yeah, you die, sir. You go to hell and you die. Yeah. So they are coming back. Alright, get up, Regina. Alright, we're not going to fight these too much. Because it looks like we're just going to take a crap ton of health damage. But, you know, uh, let's get up here, actually. Oof. That works. Although, maybe it doesn't quite work as much as I was hoping it would. Yeah, trouble is, we can't really see what we're hitting. We've burnt through 30% of our ammo here. Any more? Yeah, I don't know. I like these SMGs. They feel pretty, uh, pretty fun to use as well. At least now the T-Rex has smashed this place open. We can actually run through it. Yeah, pretty sure Dillion was stuck in here, wasn't he? Yeah, the hardware storage. Oh, hello. Key plate that Dylan threw out. Got the key plate. Uh, supercomputer. Right, so we... Okay, do we need this key plate? No. Alright, so we need to find somewhere else where we can actually use this key plate to then. Uh, oh no, we're going to have those bloody dinos back, aren't we? Yeah, going to be honest, not a huge fan of these pterodactyl things. Kind of feel like Lara Croft or something. Running around with these bad boys going. Right, we need to find... 
Yeah, I, I don't know. Sometimes she's like aiming at them. But... No, okay. She does actually hit them. Alright. Very difficult to work out whether you're actually hitting them or not. So... We've got a locked door there that's now flashing. Uh, I'm guessing that's where we're going then. Cool. Looks like these pterodactyl dickheads are back. Well, that's okay. I like points. I like extinction points. And I'm happy to farm extinction points. Make all the dinos extinct. Come on, you little fucker. Countered something somehow. Yeah, I think this game is kind of showing the problem with static camera angles. As much as we kind of like the idea of it coming back, it's definitely a, a concept of a, a gone time. Yeah. I don't think I miss static camera angles as much as I think I do. Okay, so let's go back through here. Um, oh god. Oh, that's how it. That's that's what we're talking about right there. That's the hit of the whole fruit right there. That's how we're gonna generate some cash. Oh yes. That's what we're talking about. Oh, you little sausage. He got me. He got us. He got us. I'm guessing we're supposed to be going back this way. I'm trying to work out how we switch targets halfway through. Because it, it does appear to be a way of doing it. But I'm not sure how that's working. Oh, he's not dead. Dead now. There we go. Come on. Come on, dino bastards. That's what we're talking about. Let's get that combo as high as we can. Any more? Yeah, there's always more. There we go. Lovely. Beautiful. Tapping the button seems to be where it's at for these guns. So we've got a good little combo there. But we can do better. There we go. Oh, yes. Oh, the, the humanity. Uh, I think we killed them all. That's disappointing. Yeah, so tapping the button seems to be better than just going full auto. If you go full auto, I think you're just going to waste a lot of ammo. That's okay. Uh, are we going the right way? I'm going to say no. That's unfortunate. All right, well, we'll go back. I mean, I suppose the thing with with it is it's not really a waste. No, we are. Are we going the right way? Okay, I'm a little bit confused with the map, actually. Let's go back. Um... I am confused with the map. So, we're there. Okay, so we can't actually save shop. We could go all the way back to the save shop, actually. Let's fight our way back to the save shop, just so we can rearm, reload, and all that stuff, and get back. Yeah, so you can't move the cursor around the map. Which is unfortunate, but it is what it is. Back, you overgrown fucking bastards. Oh, no. Actually, this is kind of where we want to be, isn't it? Uh, that was unfortunate. That was unfortunate. Oh, you little sausage jockey. Literally came out of nowhere. That's okay. That's okay. Ain't even mad. Ain't even mad. Yes, keep that combo going. Keep it going. Oh, 
Who would have thought blasting dinos would be so much fun, huh? I mean, I guess everybody that's played this game. But for me, this is all new. And I'm enjoying what I'm playing right now. Any more? Any more? No, I think we're good. Okay, what about in here? Oh, this is the save room, isn't it? Yeah, cool. Right, let's heal up. Recovery. Eh, we'll go for a medium med pack. That should do the job. Now, let's charge our weapons and buy some more ammo for this thing. This is going to be a real good money maker. Uh, I don't know, but I'm not sure about that one. In the stat, we have two of those. We're pretty good for health, actually. Right, let's charge this. Okay, so it's not super cheap to charge, but then that makes sense because we have so many rounds for it. And then let's bring that up to 2,000. We could go for 3,000. Should we do it? Let's do it. Because we're going to earn loads more money anyway. But Regina should be good for a while with 3,000 rounds in this thing. Um, okay. Oh, wait. This is the poison area. Oh, God. Well, that's okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're not supposed to be going back that way. Did we not get no damage bonus for that? That's a little bit strange. Uh, that is way back the way we came. And one second, guys. Okay, and we're back. Sorry about that, guys. Um, now, where were we going? Well, I think we need to go back the way we came. Uh, and it was not through there. That's the poison gate. At least we get to earn some more money again. Which is good, because we've literally just blown all of our cash on these SMGs. Which is fine. You know. One cannot have too much firepower when there are dinosaurs involved. Oh, come on. That was bollocks. That was absolutely bollocks. Come on. Now, I don't know how I'm going to do grinding in this game. I don't know whether I'm going to do the majority of it off camera. Not sure yet. It is a lot of fun. Just running around, shooting dinosaurs, trying to rack up a decent combo. Gonna be honest. Way more fun doing that than I thought it would be. Oh, man. He took it right in the face. So did he, for that matter. I don't know if counters get you critical hits or something. And I'm not sure. But it seems like sometimes we can shoot through walls or shoot through the scenery which is curious but hey we'll roll with it man look at these guys everywhere happy with that I suppose so we spent what uh, 20 grand I guess so if we can make a little bit of that back I'll be happy We've already made a good chunk of that back. Now, I don't know how many weapons and whatnot we're going to actually have in this game to grind out. Hopefully not a huge amount of them. Because this is just one way that would really lengthen the playtime of the game, I suppose. If we've got to grind out Oh, that was a nice counter. Loads and loads of weapons. But at least, you know, it's not going to hurt having loads of cash saved up, is it? Did we even get hurt on this scene? Is it worth going back to try and hunt some more? Uh, I think we killed them all. Okay. So, there isn't always loads of dinosaurs. It's not like you can grind infinitely. 
Although I suppose you could if you like exit the area and come back in. We're gonna have the hey no damage bonus. Yeah, so we've already got like almost all the money back that we spent. Yeah, I don't like this area. Don't like these things at all. They're just irritating to fight, to be honest. Really annoying to fight. Mainly because you can't really see what you're doing. I mean, that's three of them down. Alright, that was another cool grand. Now, where do we actually need to go? So, we've just come in through there. We're going to go right. Right, okay. Got ya. I think we need to go in through here, don't we? That's the way we came, I believe. <laughs> it is. Yeah, that's the way we came. That's where we're going wrong. Alright, got ya. Now, I really don't want to have to fight these bloody pterodactyls again. But running past them, I just have a feeling we're just going to get hurt. Yeah. I guess as long as we just keep backing up and moving, we should more or less be okay. Famous last words, I suppose. There we go. Damn. Yeah, we need something a little bit more effective on these things. I mean, the handgun admittedly did very little. But this isn't too bad. Right. Let's get out of here. So we've got like freaking tanks here and stuff. Which is pretty cool. Uh, that's not the way we want to go though, is it? No, here, this is what we were looking for. This is what we were looking for. Alright, that's better. We should have just dinos in here. Yep. Oh, man. These things are just insane. Yeah, there is some kind of auto lock-on system. But I'm not sure how it works. Like, sometimes you'll just switch around and aim at another dinosaur. But there doesn't seem to be much rhyme or reason behind it. Well, we're raking in the money, at least. And that's all that matters. So, let's go into the save room. We'll grab some uh, an ammo top up. Because why not, yo? Let's go shop. Yeah. Man, these things are fun. They're so much fun. Uh, so, do we need... I guess we could get... A large med pack. Yeah, so they're a cool grand. They are a cool grand. Now these small med packs, in all fairness, seem to be pretty damn good. Alright, let's go. Could have saved it, but didn't. Might might pay for that in a minute. Surprised there's no dinos here. Oh, wasn't there something here actually? The med pack medium. Hey, nice. At least we can take it this time. Electronic. Why can't I use the stun gun? Oh, can we not use the stun gun because we have to? Yeah, okay. Kind of makes sense, I suppose. A little bit annoying when you've got to use a stun gun for a key. There we go. Very annoying when you've got to use your stun gun as the key. Right. Weapon. There we go. 3,000 rounds with these should be able to carry us through just about anything. So, what are we, what are we looking at here, then? The status of the security system of the facility is shown on a big screen. Most of the lines have been cut. 
Doesn't seem to be functioning normally. That's no good. And even worse than that, I'm out of coffee. No! Oh, hello. A system which manages all the key plates. Only one key plate can be removed at a time from the system. Well, that sucks. So, I guess we've got to put keys back and only take the keys out that we need. Oh, hello. Management of key plates. This is a notification that now all facility keys will be managed in this control room. The colors of the lock terminal corresponds to the colors of the keys. Matching the colors of the keys and the terminals will release security lock. Due to security reasons, only one key can be removed at a time. Also, the key's electronic information is reprogrammed each week. For this reason, always return the key to the key control system after use. Yeah, okay. The head of this room probably sat in this seat. Many terminals are set here. Probably used for receiving reports from the other facilities. Yeah. You get a lot of um, information actually from searching areas, which I like. Okay, so. I guess we've got to manually go into our options and can't be used here. Oh, there we go. Can't we just like smash this and take all the keys? Uh, so we need, it was blue, wasn't it? Will you push the button of the system? We will choose the blue button of the system. They don't really look like plates to me either, I'm going to be honest. They look just like normal generic keys. But what do I know? Alright. Let's make a cheeky save just because I don't really want to get killed now we've done all of that. Okay, so let's hit up save, check the memory card, and drop one there. There we go. I like how quick everything is in this game as well. No long menu loading times or anything like that, which is nice. We take that for granted these days. Well, mostly. All right. See, there we go. We got hit off camera there. We didn't even really see what was going on. Yeah. Close quarters. Yeah, I, um, it's kind of interesting the way they've done the combat in this game. I'm not... I don't know. I, I don't know what to think of it yet. I don't like the way the second... Like you transition to another scene there are enemies like literally the second you do it you don't have you know even an ounce of time to think about what the fuck's going on it is an interesting choice we we'll take a small med pack small med packs seem to be pretty good in all fairness like literally as soon as you transition you have a dinosaur snout in your anus it's it's pretty crazy. Anyway, let's go save our friend. Oh, we're probably going to be Dylan again, aren't we? I don't want to be Dylan again. Boo. We're going to have to, yeah. We're going to have to get Dylan his new weapon. Item, key item. Kind of wish you could just use the key plates as well by using them. Using the item. What took you so long? Nice to see you too. You owe me one. I found a young female survivor. But she was uncooperative. I locked her up in the control shack. I'll take her back to the ship. You go on ahead. I'll meet you there. Regina has returned to the patrol ship with a girl. Okay. Just try 
try to relax. <laughs> what is wrong with you? You're a survivor, right? Please, we're here to help. What's your name? Where are all the others? Where's your family? Regina. You better come and see this. Guess we're still Regina for now. <laughs> Who trashed the place? It wasn't dinosaurs. Someone must have got in here and destroyed all the computers. The activator for the gate is broken too. We can't get back to our own time. It must have been those people with the helmets. Well, that sucks. They also damaged the engine activator. We can't even move our ship. Okay. We'll have to look for something in this world in order to get us back to our original time. And we have to find parts for the ship, too. Hey. Before you go, handcuff the girl so she won't run away. There's a facility we haven't gone to yet. You've got to check it out. Right. Well, that sucks. So they've come in and busted up our ship. Hmm. I guess we're now playing as Dilda. I mean, Dylan. Calm down. I'm here to help you. Just calm down. Look, I have to make sure you don't escape. Trust me. Do it. Stop it. What's the matter? Yeah, that was really freaking weird. She's like groping us or something. Uh, I guess she can't talk. So they've come in here and they've broken our ship. This is bad. So we're, for the foreseeable future, we're stuck here up shit creek without a paddle literally you can't even move this thing uh oh dear right well let's see what we can buy i'm glad this magic shop works and how did regina get her back uh from where she was originally locked up with six hundred thousand dinosaurs per square inch you know this is a very, very silly game. Um, oh, so, oh, we can get that for him, too. Uh, I mean, we can't really afford that, sadly. Like, I'm pretty sure, ah, so it's, I think all of our health carries over as well. Um, I'm guessing but yeah, our complete inventory, apart from the character-specific weapons, carry over. Ooh. Heavy blade. An alloy blade, which will increase the power of Dylan's machete. That's nice. I actually wouldn't mind that, but we can't quite afford it. Uh, okay. So there's a facility that we haven't yet explored. Let's go see what Regina's up to. I don't think we're going to be repairing this ship with dinosaur bones. It's an engine starting unit. The battery to start the engine has been destroyed. Ah, oh, hello. There are still areas we haven't been to. Go search for survivors. And we need that battery. Yeah, let's just hope they have one of those running around. I think Regina is now just like questioning why she decided to come here in the first place. Uh, let's go. Oh, we're on half an hour. Let's maybe... N n Ooh, we're on the ship. Yeah, we're on half an hour here, guys. Let's maybe not go. Okay. Uh, I might do some grinding. Like, it, I might do one more episode, and then I might do some gr point grinding. Just because... 
uh, I'm not going to be able to play this game after today for like a whole week because that's how my recording cycle generally works and it's shit but there we go anyway uh, we're going to leave it there thank you very much for watching when we come back I guess we're going to explore there were a couple of doors that were gated off weren't there that uh, Mr. Dylan can cut open with his machete so I think that will be our next port of call in fact I think there's one pretty close to here wasn't there I'm sure it'll be on the map anyway so thanks for watching guys and as always till next time